Hello and welcome to a tour of our Mass and Event Reservation System. Let's take a look at how easy it is to make a reservation. We click this large button here and then we can choose one of the upcoming events. We'll choose this one and here we see a very simple form with very few fields to make it very easy to sign up. We'll enter our group name. Here we can enter an email address or a phone number phone number needs to be a mobile phone so that it can receive a text message. And then how many people are in the group? You as the admin can limit the maximum number that's allowed here. And you as the admin also get to define this additional information that appears on this screen. All right, three fields. That was simple and easy. Let's click Submit. And now we see a confirmation on the screen. We also see that additional information that you can set as the admin. And we see that this information was also emailed to the user. If the user used a mobile phone, they'll receive a text message with a link to view this form. The user can also print from here, and a very nice print-ready form is created. All right, let's take a look and see what it looks like for the admin. We'll log in here as the admin. Here we have a list of the events, and we can see the total spots in the event, as well as the remaining spots. With each submission, an email is also sent to the admin, and at the bottom of that email is also an updated count of how many spots remain. So those emails can also make it easy for you to see how many spots are available as you're on the go and receiving those emails. If for any reason you need to change the total number of spots, you can do so here if for some reason you're able to increase your capacity after you've already created the event. You can make that change here. Let's take a look at some of the existing reservations. Here we click on reservations and we choose an event. And here's a list of our upcoming reservations. If for some reason you need to make a note such as seat assignments, you can do that here. This is completely optional, but we've heard requests from some of our parishes and so we've added it. You click save and now you've made a note that goes with this reservation. That note will appear when you print or export this file. You can export this as an Excel file. Let's take a look at the print preview. You can see a nice print ready format with an extra field here. If you print this, you could use this field to physically with a pen or pencil check off when someone comes in. Or as I mentioned, you can export this to a Excel file if you'd like to work with it digitally and then you can adjust which event you're looking at. There's also an ability to make some changes in settings. You can change your name and contact information. You can change the number of people allowed in the reservation and this is where you can add the note. This note will appear on the sign up form, on the confirmation screen, and in the confirmation email or text message. The last thing we need to show you is how to create an event and that is also very easy. You give the event a name you choose the date and you choose the time. Finally, you choose how many spots are allowed or how many seats or people are allowed at that event. We'll say 100 and we see our event was added right here at the bottom and if we go back out our new event appears here. When the number of spots is reduced to zero this reserve button will go away. Let's take a look and simulate what that might look like. This is how the system is able to reduce the number of allowed spots. We'll reduce the, we'll reduce the number of spots allowed here to eight. There we see zero spots remaining and we'll go back out and see what it's like for a user. And we see in red zero spots remaining and the reserve button is gone. So no more reservations can be made. If there's only three spots remaining, the system will recognize that. It will include the reserve button, but it will prevent the user from making a reservation greater than three. So under normal circumstances, you will not be able to exceed your limit, which is the entire purpose of the program to uh, limit your attendance at these events. Let's go back in as the admin. And again, we can see our list here. In this particular case, if we got a few more spots, we could up this to 12. We could go back out and we could see that four spots remain. And we'll see here that we can only go up to four. So the system will prevent too many people from making a reservation. And again, we'll just take a quick look at existing reservations. They're listed here. You can add a note if you want to. This is optional. 
and you can print and export from here. I hope this helps. Thanks so much.